There's no outside food. In ah, welcome to Mary's Travel Blog, and today I'm in Dayton, Ohio, at the Air Force Museum. Yeah. Look at all those engines. Hi, welcome to Mary's Travel Blog and today I'm in Dayton, Ohio. Inside, of course, the Air Force Museum. And it is huge and really a nice place to visit. And I encourage you to come here if you ever get the chance to come to Dayton, Ohio. And in this building, there are lots of engines, planes. The Wright Military Flyer in 1909. First aviation mechanic, Charles Taylor. And this is one of the early wind tunnels of aviation. And it was made around 1906. This is from World War One. World War One. Rotary engine. Quentin Roosevelt. And a wooden grave by German troops at the time. And of course, we're still in the World War I section. I even kind of like these like model airplanes as well, too. I think, remember what they call them, the torpedo thing? Size models, they're just hanging in this building, too. I like it where you can just touch this right here. Is, is it red light on? Yes. You can touch this, and uh, he says you can touch me. Like this is the kind of this, the bare frame, and then the canvas on it. And then later on, we have two coats, and three coats, and then four coats plus color. So that's one demonstration that I like, and uh, you can just come up and touch this. And um, so that's one way where I, 
I like learning about the airplanes, so. So thanks for. And the basic simple planes that led to our more modern day. Huh. I'm sure glad I didn't have to send a plane like that today. Look at how these wings look today. Wow. The Ford Model T Ambulance. The first of its kind. Yes. And this is the back of the Model T Ambulance. And some more aircraft engines. And this is about the engine evolution between World War One to early 1940. Now the engines evolved. And Here's somebody fixing up the plane. And there's our army jeep. I think now we're getting closer into World War II. The father of blind flight. The museum, they like to focus on the women of aviation. And her name is... Well, a flight training mishap. Following the instructor, following the student, in. I would hate to hear what they're saying. I like this how you can see how the wheel goes up inside. Oh, yeah. This is the wing. And now we're going to a different section of the museum. I think we're going to go see some WW2 stuff. So come on. The child's prized possession. Looks like the. Okay, and I think they said some. The child's prized possession, like the. Um, this is 1938 Nazis, some. Um, Jews of Germany. Child's. Okay, this is part of the Holocaust exhibit here. 
Okay, this is very sentimental and um, part of the German history of World War II. It's that in, in student art contest. And the tattoo had on there. Um, of the Pacific. Okay, these are leather bomber jackets and evolution of U.S. Air Force. 1980. Over here we get Southeast Asia, Vietnam, Cold War, and Korea. Simulator rides and um, you can pay an extra fee. Virtual reality. There's several virtual things here. Vietnam, Laos, and Cambodia. And that air, up in that thing right there too, when the, it was Air Force jet. A city held hostage. Woman of the level. Plane. I guess they just got off school and Berlin airlift dog parachute. And this is the Berlin airlift radio receiver. We're here at the space stuff. I think if I kept your. Yeah, well, I'm on the ground and this is so tall. And I'm just like, wow. I think we may just have to go up to the overhead so you can get a better view of these rockets. So I'm on the ground and... And there's an astronaut hanging up over there. Well, no, it's a display. And, um... I'm not sure what that is. I think it's... And wouldn't you know, and like right next to the space shuttle, do you know what they've got? Dinosaurs! I don't know how far I can time you. And they got dinosaurs here. Metal dinosaurs next to the space shuttle. I mean, more, more could you have ever imagined? What, what would I ever find about that? But okay. And of course. The United States of America Air Force Jet. And some artifacts of Air Force One. We fly the, we fly the President. Oh, I like this thing with Legos here. On this plane. For nine minutes. Yeah. Okay. Excellent. Air Force One. Yeah. I've been on. Twice. Okay. Where do we get in? Up there. Okay. 
Oh, are we gonna go in? Yeah, we go in, in this direction and other things. Oh, I'm going hunting. <laughs> Let's go. We came here for this. Okay. And now, folks, I'm going to get on the Air Force One. I'm so excited. So come on with me. We're, we're getting on the plane. I'm going underneath the wing. And this is the same plane that JFK went on. And I've got to go through a narrow gateway. To and finally get on Air Force One. And I can't believe it. Okay. Well, let's see. Right here we have where the pilots flew. Very small space. And a map of the airplane, the cockpit. Okay, the galley, and the seats. And, um, okay, little seats by the airplane. Very tight in here. The TV. Is oh, what's the phone? <laughs> this is best door. That must be the presidential suite. And now we're coming back to where the the press would be probably at. I mean, interesting. Telephones, old IBM typewriters. I mean, phones by everybody's chair. Yeah. We're going to in to make their meals and the toilets. And out we come. And now, folks, we just completed Air Force One. And here's some other jets that you can see here in Dayton. Well, I have them that was very tight and cramped. But of course, they got the plexiglass in there. But hey, you only live one. Now, folks, I'm in front of the mocked up space shuttle, so I think I'm gonna go in and see what they have. The space shuttle will be. So come on in with me, and we're going inside the mocked up space shuttle. This is through the cargo doors. Mid deck. Okay. I, s I think I recognize you. Do you ever shoot like Civil War events? Yes, I was. I met you. I was the Lincoln Convention. I recognize you. So I thought, well, I'll come while I've got the time.
And this is a memorial post to all those there.